Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Kim, and today I thought I would show you the um, the things I got from the mystery box that was um, available at Country Craft Creations. It came in the mail, and um, I couldn't wait to dig in and see what was in there. Um, it's exactly what it says. It's a mystery. So she, uh, at the end of certain seasons, you know, when she's bringing in new materials and new uh, paper lines, she kind of cleans off the shelf, and so she offers a great um, sale for the people who. Um, are on her scrapbookers of country craft creations page and so I thought I would share with you what I got so um, I got some stickers that are by Prima and it they're puffy and it looks like it's the Santorini uh, line but the flamingos and stuff are really cute these these would be cute in my planner there were three things that related to the photo play paper crane uh, series there's the layered 3D stickers that came in mind. Now all these boxes are different too. So what I'm showing you is what I got, but not everybody gets the same thing. Along with that was the ephemera for paper crane. And then the 12 by 12 sticker sheet. So there wasn't any paper that came with this one, but because of the amount of ephemera and stuff that came with it, I think I could still make something really easy just um, using solid colored papers instead. But um, so that's something different. This is not something I would normally purchase, but I think that I could do something cute with it. Now we get into things that I definitely could use. That's the only thing that I probably was like, eh, everything else was awesome. Um, so I got the frames and tags by Echo Park for the Alice in Wonderla uh, Wonderland collection, along with, this was perfect, the designer dies. And I love word dies. Um, I always like to add like an inspirational word on it, a tag that I make. Or, you know, um, when I do a cluster of flowers in the corner, I like to have a word come out. So the, this was perfect. Um, it says dream, magical things, friends, and sparkle. So it was like it was handpicked for me. And then the 6x6 collection to go with it. So I loved this. I thought it was really cute. So Alice in Wonderland. Um, I have a happy birthday sticker. Uh, not sticker, uh, stamp. And the stamps that go with the Alice in Wonderland. So there's sayings on this too. Anywhere from one word like magic to a saying like we daydream about impossible things. Um, all our dreams can come true if we have the courage to pursue them. So I really liked all the sayings on this too. So I like word um, words and sayings for stamps and die cuts and stuff. So that was awesome. This is perfect. Now normally I'd be like, uh, baby collection, but the paper is so pretty and I have some friends um, that I teach with who are currently pregnant. So this was actually perfect for me. Um, to me, this is a little bit more girly. Um, so I need to wait for someone to have a girl. I know some, well, there's some girl stuff in, or there's a couple boy things in here. Oh, you know what? It looks like the front is more girly and the back is more... I don't know. Anyway, it's uh, the Heaven Scent collection, and it's awesome. And then some of the um, for my uh, Fern Studio, what's it called? Blue Fern Studio, the seedlings in pink. And three different colors of seam binding that I think is going to match that Heaven Scent. I think that's why they put it in there together. Um, I got some other paper collections and uh, random things also. So let me start with next the Chamel collection box of crayons so I got pretty much a full collection of this and it's real bright vibrant pretty uh, kind of cutesy stuff and it kind of reminds me of school so it's perfect for me um, these are the uh, glitter shaker stickers so I love those um, this is um, what are they called there's stickers um, and a folder huh that's different and then um, the letter stickers are in there there's a bunch of different letter stickers. There is the um, another thing of stickers that are sparkly. The pencils, you're so sweet, ice cream, the paintbrush, everything's just real vibrant and cheery. This is the writing pad. So as a teacher, I would just use this to actually leave on my desk and leave from notes to myself, but I might incorporate it into some sort of um, Traveler's Notebook Journal too. So then there was some other paper that came with that, some 12 by 12 sheets. Um, this one's called Snapshot, and they're all double-sided. 
This one's Promise. Pick your own. Um, is this really called Cut Here? Yeah, I think this is called Cut Here. Oh yeah, because it's scissors. <laughs> Take a walk with some cute terrier dogs and paintbrushes. And then some cut aparts that say, um, this is called Say Yes Often with yellow on the back. This is Cat's Meow. I'll definitely be using the heart side. People who know me know that I am very much afraid of cats. Um, countdown. A new thought. So these colors are just really vibrant. And that's the spirit. Oh, that's donut. <laughs> so that will be, that was a nice that, that when they put these mystery boxes together, they don't just throw things in. They really think about um, the collections and put, giving you enough materials to actually make something. So that was the Chamel box of crayons that was in my kit, my mystery box. And I got... Now this one is why I was so excited because a good friend of mine is pregnant with a little boy and so I'm going to make her an album and so this was perfect uh, and this look I think when I see this it looks like her style too so I love you to the moon and back that's cute with the cow three little pigs bundle of joy I'm not going to take them out but um, this is cartabella paper I love these I'll probably just make, um, I don't know how many pieces, how, what's in here, but I'll probably just make a small like four by six album or something. And there's more. You get a, this I was thrilled about because it is different sheets that match the Authentique and Bow Bunny collections. I'm taking this one out. But um, these are so handy to have because they match their collections. And so when you need something that's not so wild and crazy, um, you can add this to your albums, but there's all different colors, yellow, brown, green. Okay. And that's the authentique. And then there's also some bow bunny. And so these are really, this is the double dot collection. And so there's dots on one side and then a pattern on the other. So, I mean, these are perfect. It's like they look to see whose name ordered and then said, oh, she would like this. And they were right. So different colors. I love them all. And these can go with just about, I mean, it doesn't have to go with a bow bunny or a, an authentic collection. Sometimes they match other papers too. So I was thrilled about that. And then the last is my favorite. You'll see in just a second. Sorry for the crinkle. Oh, I'll put this in there a minute. The last one. Oh no, yeah, this is the last one. Sorry, crinkle, crinkle. Is Blue Fern, and it's the Easter collection. And I don't have this, and it's so beautiful. I'm actually going to take these out to show you. I'm pretty sure that these have sold out. Um, so. Um, I'm not showing this to you to say na na na. I'm showing you this to say, hey, next time that she has this sale, get on there and get them ordered because it's a hot deal. This paper is so thick. I haven't used it in a while. And now that I feel it, I'm like, oh, it's really a sturdy, sturdy paper. So it looks like there's two of each. And that, oh, there's like a lace. Mm -mm -mm. Yep, this is me. The purple. And I don't think I've made an Easter album, so great opportunity. This is really pretty, the flowers. And these little rabbits are cute. Sometimes rabbits can be kind of scary on paper. Like they're like, ooh, but this is cute. Purple on the back. The colors are real springy and bright. Uh, they're a muted color, but they're still real cheery. This is a yellow with the flowers on the edge. I like this gazebo. And on the back of that one is some pink. This one has another rabbit and basket, purple background, flowers at the top. The collection's called Spring Parade. Green on the back. A little chick, that's cute. Stripe on the back, that's purple. Six by six cut aparts. Oh, 
I got these. And then a yellow print on the hound's tooth on the back. So two of those. And I think that, nope, there's still one more pattern. This per like Easter, very Eastery. I just, uh, makes me want to say, he is risen. <laughs> and on the back. Oh, that's really pretty. There's like a floral on there. There's more. I thought that was the end. Wow, there's a lot in here. Perfect. This is like a basket weave. I love collage pages. Now this has got to be the last one. Yeah. Uh, this pink one with the chicks at the bottom. And then on the back is a pattern. So that was the uh, mystery box for this fall from Country Craft Creations. Um, you never know what you're going to get, but it's always quality. And she always, they really think about, you know, what will go together and can you use it. And so they usually put um, a variety of things in for the same collection. So I feel really fortunate to have gotten a box, guys. And um, I can't wait to start digging in. Uh, thanks for watching and visit CountryCraftCreations.com. Thanks.